hello everyone in this video we are just going to study in detail about logical operators in c language let's get started so these kinds of logical operators in c language is a binary type operator which requires at least two operands for proper operation and the most widely used logical operations in c language are logical and logical or and logical not so let's study in detail about each of these three logical operators available let's take an example for understanding logical and first so in a program you can clearly see on the screen if variable a is having the value minus 40 and variable b is having the value 60 and if c is equal to a ambison ambison of b so this ambison ambison is nothing but it is representing logical and if it is having only one ambison it means it is bitwise and so there is a major difference between bitwise and and logical and so if it is logical and it must be having two different ambison symbols so if c is equal to a ambison ambison b is nothing but a logical and of b so a is having the value minus 40 and b is having the value 60 what could be the value of c so most often these kinds of logical operators also yields the value in binary it will yield only one or zero if the condition is true it will yield the result one or if it is zero it will yield the result zero so in our case a is having the value minus 40 and b is having the value 60 so you must check whether the value of any of the operand is zero or not even if it is negative it is not having the value 0 so you can see in our case variable a is having the value 40 but it is not 0 so it is a true value so a is a true value and b is nothing but 60 it is also a true value true ambition of true is nothing but true as we know in the truth table of and gate two inputs is required for AND gate and one output will be produced so 0 0 will provide us 0 as the output 0 1 will provide us 0 and 1 0 will be also providing us the result 0 and 1 1 will be providing us the value 1 in the output so this is the truth table of AND gate right so in our case A is having the value true that is true value minus 40 it is not 0 and b is also having the value 60 which is also true so true ambition of true will provide us the result true and all the other combinations will be yielding us the result 0 so in our case we will be getting the output true so c will be having the value 1 in our case so this is how logical and will be performing and it will be yielding us the result true or false or 1 or 0 to the result variable so most often these logical operations will be performed using the truth table respective truth table in our first case we refer to the and gate truth table right similarly for or we will be referring or gate truth table and for not we will be referring not gate truth table so let us discuss about the logical or let us take the same two variables let us take the let us take the same two variables a is equal to minus 40 b is equal to 60 so c is equal to a logical r of b so here also you can see two vertical lines indicates the symbol of logical r if it is having only one vertical line it means bitwise r so there is a major difference between bitwise and logical so a Two vertical lines b means a logical r of b let us take the truth table of logical r so it will be also having two inputs and one output so 0 0 is 0 0 1 is 1 1 0 is 1 and 1 1 is 1 in logical r truth table so in our case a is true 
b is also true it is not zero you can clearly see even the a value is negative number it is not as zero so it is true value so a is a true value that is one and b is also a true value that is also not equal to zero and one so one or of one will produce us the output of one in our c variable and let us discuss about logical not so a is equal to minus 40 c is equal to not of a so this logical not requires only one operand for basic and simple operation and let us look into the truth table of logical not you can see if the input is zero we will be getting the output true and if the input is true we will be getting the output zero so this is not so this is logical not so in our case variable a is holding the value minus 40 which is a true value or it is 1 so not of 1 will produce the output 0 so c will be having the value 0 as the result so this is how logical not will be functioning and it will be yielding as the output of 1 or 0 so now i am just going to try out the same example right over here a is equal to minus 40 b is equal to 60 and c i am just going to get the result c is equal to a ampersand ampersand of b print of a ampersand ampersand of b is equal to c percentage d comma C. Next expression I am just going to perform logical R. So C is equal to A R of B. So A R of B. And the next expression, I'm just going to evaluate not of A. Not of A. So now I'm just compiling this program. So let us check whether the output is as expected in our C program. That is, in our case, this will be yielding as the output 1. So C will be having the output or the value 1 here also we will be having the 1 as the result and here we will be having 0 as the result I am just running this program you can see as per our expectation we are having the result 1 1 in logical and and logical or and logical not is having the value 0 that's it So I hope you understood the logical and logical or and logical not in this video and how these logical operators are evaluated in C program. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.